Chewa Fetu, what's up? Welcome to another beautiful, fun and exciting episode of Cars, Stands and Class. I'm your nice, good, beautiful host, Mkubi the Entertainer. Before I tell you a lot of things, I'll talk to you right after this. I hope you saw the message that if you want to be on the show, you can be on the show. Just make sure you send an email to costandslash at gmail.com. That is costandslash at gmail.com. Or alternatively, send your WhatsApp message to this WhatsApp number 10 below and you can be on Cost and Send Class. And today, Buffett, we are in Jobek CBD. We're meeting our nice good friend by the name of Cabello. He drives a very beautiful car. It's white. It's clean. I heard it's an... No, if I tell you a lot, you'll actually log off. You'll leave this video before you actually reach the interview and everything else. Right now, let's go and meet Gabelo with his nice, beautiful, cool ride. Check out Gabelo of it. Let's go see Gabelo. Cabello Bosa. Chef Ferin Jack. Hey, Tada. Finally, we ended up meeting up. Yeah. I'm afraid. It's been a minute. I'm afraid. Sure. Didn't some rock? I'm not in charge. It's just a chilled Sunday. Chilled Sunday. Sure. Chilled vibes, even. Chilled vibes. Sure. Well, Cabello, thank you for being on the show. And normally, when I have people on the show, before we get into details about their car and everything else, they tell us more about themselves. Who's Cabello, bro? Aish, Kabel is like a, a normal kid from the hood on tour. Uh -huh. I blom in, in Folo. Okay. Yeah, I'm just a... Like Folo is in Soweto? Soweto, yeah. Okay. Just an ordinary being. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 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 yeah. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. Alright, so... I see you driving a nice Ford Fiesta Figo? Figo. Figo. Figo yeah. It's the new Figo. Yeah, it's the new Figo, 2018 model. 2018? Yeah. It's your baby. It's my first boy. First born. First car. Eh, 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 you still have a long way to go, <laughs> yeah. So tell us about the car. So originally the car I bought when I got like two years with the car, I just started pimping it out like this year. Okay. So, like, two years, standard. Standard. Like with the Wabona Kana King Diding's wool cap and eh? yeah. <laughs> cap. There's actually a guy that you interviewed uh, mm -hmm. with the same car. Mm -hmm. Oh, Walker. Yeah, yeah white, Walker. white Walker. His brother is mm -hmm. my, like, he was a colleague. We used to work at the same place. Right? Oh, so, so you uh, know each other? Yeah. Guys, the guy is talking about, please check this video out. Check this video out. Here, yeah. it's his video. This thing up here, you see this thing up the screen? Yeah, this thing popped out here. Check that guy's interview. He's the one who made sure that he is on this show. <laughs> sure. Sure, boy. So every day, like, when we park, I'd get first at work and he, like, obviously I'd park. And he makes sure he parks next to me just to get a pleasure. I there go for a tea and stuff like that. So I would have that pleasure. I was like, hey, So he shows you before and after. Yeah, I'm told. So yeah, though, so this year I decided it's game. Fuck. I I have to make sure I, I, I do something to this car and told. Mm -hmm. So yeah, first things first, I, I, I dropped it before the max or anything. You dropped it? Yeah. Dropped How did you drop it? Did you compress? Did you So first the beginning of the year, obviously, January, nobody has money. I cut the springs. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. With the intentions, obviously, I'm going to get better suspensions after that. Okay? Just mm -hmm. to see how is it sharp. Before that, it. were there any, any, any disadvantages when you cut your springs? So now what I noticed is that uh, like the, the, the shocks wears out much quicker. Quicker, okay. Because after I cut it, it was like normal. They didn't have any bouncy stuff, whatever, mm -hmm. whatever, whatever. But as like I drove, I started Okay, yeah, and, the shocks are gone. You don't have shocks. Yeah, the shocks were born. And it started making like squeaky sounds. How mm -hmm. Oh, okay. And yeah. for your new car, that is and rather. That didn't irritated me, my guy. That irritated me a lot. So, um, what I did was, yeah, I bought coils. Um, I, I, I installed coils, and yeah, it's sitting on coils now. So guys, he made sure that he's a, he's having coils and then he removed the springs because he felt like the car is squeaky and it's a new car basically. So, yeah. If it starts squeaking, I mean, uh, we're not talking about it's 10 year old case. car. So it, it, you would feel that something is wrong. So that's why he changed. Now it, you put it on coils. Yeah, Which coils are you using? Jom. Jom. Yeah. Where did you get them and how much? 
Uh, yo, I can't really, I, I can't really remember. It was seven k for uh, with the installation as well. Mm-hmm. The thing is, I bought a few stuff at, like at the same time. Like, okay. what did I buy? Lock nuts. Mm-hmm. Um, okay, how much did you spend on all of those test sets? Lock nuts, uh, coils, and all of those. Yeah, seven. Seven k. Seven k. Yeah. And installation and, as well. Yeah. So when I bought it, they said like installation is gonna be free. Okay. Uh, I think it's included somehow in the in the thing. So I think the 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 they they costed like the price was it was was seven point five or something like that. Or mm-hmm. I negotiated down to make sure everything is included in the seven k. Yeah, the the lock nut, nice. and the wheel protector, uh-huh. one of those things. Just that my those lips. Yeah, that lip protector. Yeah, I see it. Yeah, it's the very problem popular. Is, mine is that like when I drive, it it, it goes off. Until Why? I don't understand. Maybe it's because your rim is not poked out yeah, that this much. Is, yeah, this is like a standard rim, yeah, Ford Fiesta. So what I did here is, uh, yeah, I just like painted it black, matte black. Okay, go. Cool. We're still on the suspension part. Yeah. So you spend around 7K and which brand? It's Jom, ne? Jom, Jom. yeah. Are, are these coilovers coil universal or they're just for this? No, they're car. for a particular car. So it's I think it, it fits this new age. Figo and the new, fi- new Fiesta. Okay. Yeah. Cool. So, who assisted you through all of this? Because you were you were still a virgin to what stands. <laughs> you were still a virgin. Like, who came, who who took your hand and brought you? Like, okay, get these things, get this. Because you were gonna get crazy things. Yeah, definitely. Um, the guy. Um, Horsey. Orbos, no, Horsey is the younger brother of Orbos. Oh, okay. White Walker is owned by Orbos. Oh, okay. So yeah, um, Orbos was actually the guy that I went to. Hey, my guy. So I want to do this, 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 that, that. Okay. He's like, nah, the best way is this, it's either yeah. get air or get Quailies. coils. Yeah. Or any other thing, don't compress, don't, you know, those kind of things. Yeah. It doesn't trust those. So, yeah, because of budget, maybe we'll, we'll get to air, maybe <laughs> not. <laughs> That's you the know. ultimate destination. Yeah, well, it's, it's, I feel like it's preference, I'm told. Because, mm-hmm. yeah, I had a choice of, of getting air or, or coils. Mm-hmm. And, and I thought Fede A is 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 uh, convenient and tall. Mm-hmm. On humps, not uh, you go out. You just choose. You know, no. So mm. I was like, "Ish coil it easy. Um, if it happens a bag bust or whatever, it's about I'm paranoid." Right? Yeah. So I feel like if uh, a bag bust or something, the car sits down. Done. Nah, I like one o'clock a.m. Who am I gonna call? Like one of those kind of things. So, oh, there are there are more disadvantages towards A. Not that they are more for you, for yeah, you for personally, because this is an interview. You're talking about you here. Sure, yeah. For me, yeah, I'm paranoid. Yeah. Yeah. I think I, I think of a lot of stuff before I wasn't actually doing it. I'm told. Yeah. So yeah, I decided wait again. Let me rather go uh, thing for coils. Coils. If like I need to go down, like maybe for a car show or anything, mm-hmm. you'll I, go down. Yeah, I'll go down. Yeah. I can still go down. I can still go up. I wanna. Get my you. daily height is actually determined by I wanna go charity. Uh huh. Cause I get na njebe, yeah, <laughs> yes, great, but that. Uh, yeah, shh, oh boy. Yeah. So I didn't want to go lower, cause you don't uh, want to lose it. You don't want to lose it. Yeah, cause I feel like I wanna the more njebe, like uh, if it had more pressure, they don't disturb a bump and then yeah. bump, bump like bump and your car is very ugly. Yeah. Okay, cool. Let's talk about the things you changed. Uh, let's go to the rims. You changed those rims. You said it wasn't this way. Yeah, it wasn't. You had a choice of getting um, other rims, like popular rims. We know uh, uh, Posh Mesh, uh, BBS. Why did you go for this Ford rims? Uh, Firstly, it's because I wanted to stand out. I wanted to be the only guy. Mm -hmm. Because I know a lot of Figos, even the previous uh, model, they have Mesh, they have BBS, and whatnot, whatnot. Yeah. So I wanted to stand out to be the only guy with the Figo. And I. I've only seen it's 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 White Walker uh, uh, and me that actually dropped this car, this this version of yeah, the Yeah, that's right. Yeah, I've never seen anybody. So he has had mesh. He has had I don't know the other the other rims. Yeah. So already people had that image. That, yeah, of, that image. Yeah, of a figure with this rim. So so I wanted to be like an outcast. Bring yeah, something different. Bring something different. And you so literally I, did that. Yeah, I, I I just bought like a, a standard Fiesta rims. Mm. It's not a ST. It's not like it's, it's standard, standard Fiesta. Yeah. yeah. So I just painted them black. So they didn't come as black as they are now, right yeah, now. I went to go spray paint them. Not no. spray. Yeah, I, I took them to Gosana. 
Uh, go white seat. Mm -hmm. sure. So, how much did it cost you? Uh, because the problem with buying like second hand rims is because you don't know how, like in what conditions they come. Because oh, yeah. when I saw them, it was nah. I put them in and I, I could feel these rims are not straight. Mm -hmm. They kind of like skew and yeah. stuff like that. So when I went to like stretching them, make it straight, um, yeah, that's when they said uh, we will uh, spray paint uh, them for you. Uh, like the whole thing is gonna cost 1.6. Oh, okay, cool. But so you are a guy of bargains. You just make sure that you get a package wherever you go. I negotiate everywhere. <laughs> I, I guess it comes with pink tag here. <laughs> I, I guess it comes with pink yeah. yeah, I like negotiating with everything. So, yeah. Cool. So, what are other edits? I can see that um, you changed your early lights there. You edit. So I think it, it was one of the first things I did to the mm -hmm. car. I put LED lights, the park lights is LED as well, mm -hmm. and there's a fog light. Yeah. Sure. You love this car. You're taking care of this baby hey, of yours. Hey, I don't want anything. <laughs> so, performance-wise, did you change anything performance-wise? Nah, not even. It's just the sound that I changed. Uh, okay. How I big is the engine first? It's a 1.5 engine. 1.5. Sure. So you didn't change anything there? No. It's, it's what did you do? There. What did you do in? Um, I just inserted a coil. A I mean, not a coil, a cone. A cone? Yeah. Because, yeah, I'd, like, the pressure, there's another guy, Wafi uh Ego. -huh. Uh -huh. So, <laughs> so, like, hey. so the, the, what does the cone do? The cone just changes the... The sound. Okay. The sound of the car. So, only the cone? No, you didn't do anything to the exhaust and... No, no, no. It's just a cone. Okay. I didn't know that. We're learning, right? Yeah. So you can change the sound just by adding the cone. You don't need to change your exhaust. Yeah. Go to wherever they change no, pipes and whatnot. No, I like things standard. If, like, I feel like if you want a fast car, rather buy a fast car. Yeah. Well, that's just how I feel. Okay. I wanna. I don't wanna change the exhaust or anything. It's just like the sound of it. Like I get you. So I see the mud flaps there. You have in special mud flaps. Do you come with the car or you just edit them and whatnot? No, actually, I haven't seen there's a like these mud flaps on a Figo before, but mm -hmm. I ordered them from Fig uh, Ford, straight. Okay. Yeah. So they said these are Figo mud flaps? Yeah, these are Figo mud flaps. Even on the packaging, like it's showing this car, mm -hmm. this Figo. Right. So tell me about the future plans you have for this car. What should you expect from this car? Uh, well, when I, in terms of sound, the sound I'm kind of like, Skeptical. Skeptical of it because mm -hmm. for me, sound that thing, it's 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 nah, yeah. Total. So you're like playing the with the sound which came with the car. Yeah, standard. So for me, in the car driving, it, 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 it's nah. I, won't. Mm -hmm. I might put it in, I might not. I'm told. But yeah, you you it's something that you're just thinking about, but then sure. you're not paying attention that yeah, much. You're like, ah, we'll see when you get there. Yeah, I have actually sound good too. It's just uh, 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 thing who who install yeah. and stuff. Yeah. So, cut off, I don't know why. <laughs> ah, you'll get there. I'll get you'll there, you'll get yeah, the motivation. Yeah, for now, uh, yeah, I, 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 for now, I, I, I can't think of anything to add on this car. Uh -huh. It's uh -huh. just the rims. Uh, maybe I might just get another set of OEM rims. Yeah, actually, okay. I want to get like bigger rims. Okay. Like for my 16. Uh -huh. yeah. So, you're, you're an OEM guy? Yeah, I'm, I'm OEM. I feel like uh, OEM gives less problems. Yeah. Until, yeah. Right. So if someone, this is a tricky question. If someone comes to you and say, bruh, I want to buy your car. <laughs> how much would you sell it for? Or are you just going to shut the door in their face? You have to give me like a, a price more. Okay, it's okay. I, I can You're not tempted. Yeah, yeah, I can not show you. So it's okay. But it's not up for sale. I love this car. It's my mm. first car. I feel like there's more I wanna I can I can do with it. Yeah. Uh yeah, I need sunroof as well. Mm -hmm. I want sunroof. So uh -huh. yeah, sunroof, yeah. The the previous v uh, uh, guy I had had an, a, a, a sunroof on his gets yeah. and he said he's, he paid up until 19k. Yeah, so you so should shit. really hey. be exercise your pockets there. Hey, hey, hey. Yeah, I, I I guess maybe Lina wanna he said it's like a king mini cooper. Yeah, mini, mini cooper, cooper sunroof, sunroof yeah. Yeah, I'll, 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 I'll shop around on tour, like I said before. It's about another, I said, let's try to a roof, see you on tour. Yeah. Not all cars are the same. Yeah, you are like, right. Yeah, all the cars are. So I want, uh, I'll shop around for a car that's like, uh, can I get roof are the same on tour, mm -hmm. so that 
even if they, they fuck up like the installation because that's like worries me yeah yeah when, when installation is fucked up i can still come back somehow come back, yeah. until, like, and, and, yeah. okay Camelo, Brian, you told us a lot about your car you told us a lot we've seen how clean your car is we've seen how good <laughs> it is how fresh you kept it i mean there's only so much that yeah. we can talk about on this car but all in all it's a clean car man it's a clean car and we're hoping that you're going to keep it this way and when you have something else to add onto your car what it be i don't know what it is that you might add whatever that you add feel free to contact us and then we can actually have you again on this show and no get to problem, talk about no the new things and new developments no yeah for now guys bro i i have to bid you goodbye bro and move on it was thank nice you, having you. you on the show cabello Thank you, thank you, thank you. Perfect. Don't forget that if you also want to be on the show, you can be on the show. Just make sure you send an email to costandslash at gmail.com. That is costandslash at gmail.com. Or alternatively, send a WhatsApp message to this WhatsApp number written below. And you and your car can be on costandslash. From Mingubi, the entertainer, I'm out of here. Amen. Cheers.